In this video, I'm going to show you how our Photoshop files are organized. I will detail both the Photoshop CS3 Plus and the uh, Photoshop Elements files. So let's get started first by uh, a look at the uh, template.psd. This is the uh, file that is for the uh, CS3 and up versions of Photoshop. Um, inside of this document, there is uh, six different uh, layer groups. Um, we have a guides layer that shows you um, the uh, print guide area, so we can uh, turn that on. And that just shows you where you should not have any elements that could be trimmed by your printer. Watermark, which uh, just tells you where you got it, just in case you forgot. Uh, the text layer, um, especially on strips, we have a left and right inside of there. All of your text elements will be in there for easy editing. The overlay.png file, this uh, will, will control your overlay elements. Some of our designs will have a color adjust layer in there so that you can quickly tweak that. This particular design does not. Photoshop or photo spots, this just shows you the XY coordinates. Um, you can easily hide that and you can see that goes away. And then we have the background.jpg. The background.jpg will contain the background pattern. I can turn on and off here. Um, this one has a mass layer. And then it also will contain the uh, colors. Uh, many of our new designs have quick adjust colors in them. Some of the older ones will have the uh, color adjust, which is a hue saturation layer. So that's it for the uh, Photoshop file. We'll take a look here at Photoshop Elements now for those of you using it. So Photoshop Elements uh, is not capable of the layer groups. So outside of the layer groups missing, all the files will be the same, or all the layers within the file are the same. We have the uh, watermark layer, and then we have all of our text. Uh, for the Photoshop Elements files, we denote left and right so that you know which uh, text fields you're dealing with. So there's Jennifer on the left and Jennifer on the right. And we have uh, our overlay.png file. Again, if there's a hue sat adjust layer, it will sit above this. We have our photo spots, in this case, the three up top. And then we have our background layer with the pattern and mask. And then all of our layers. Um, this design has the David's Bridal color palette, which I will uh, show in a uh, future video. But uh, for now, that is it.